Hey guys and welcome back to Gold Quest Valley. Now then, in today's episode we are going to be improving this area. Uh, we're going to get a tractor, possibly on loan, and a cultivator and plow. So we're going to make a pathway that leads into this area. Um, so that should be quite good. Um, uh, so what I'm just doing at the moment is I'm putting some of the equipment in the sheds. Just so I sort of know where it is and we don't lose it keeps it out of the way of the uh, bigger equipment when it comes um, but what I will do is I'll just clear the area of where I need the path going just so I know so I'll just back over this um, so I'll be in here possibly um, then just to sort of future proof ourselves we'll have one going all the way up here to the edge um, wasn't my original plan um, but we'll possibly have like for example a perimeter type path uh, so you know what we'll go over and we'll see is it worth being able to put a path in on the other side I eventually want a fence there hmm. no no we'll put it in this side I'd say So, I'll make this a bit bigger. There we go. So, what we'll do is we'll pop this back in here. Uh, we'll get rid of that stump, I think. We'll do that now. And, oh, that's annoying. I don't even have an implement to roll that back over. So we're going to have to uh, save up quite a lot of money for a uh, skid steer at some point as that's sort of my next goal is to be able to get the skid steer so we can start even more of the uh, more professional work really. gone so we'll have a look at how much a bigger tractor is to hire as if it's more than two thousand pounds then uh, we'll just use this one so then we'll go on the google have a look um 65 55 73 t5 let's see select lease is nine thousand no no way we go for that. Um, so just use this, I think. Oh, early man actually has got a bit more horsepower. Four grand note. I'll just use this. Um, so cultivator, we want that. Although, go for the front cultivators there. I'll just buy that. I think. Yeah. Plows. So I'm going to go for the south of there. Don't have enough money. No, because £30,000 is a rip off for a plow. So, what we'll do is we will go over and we'll have to lease it, unfortunately. Um, or we could sell the logs. Um, right. Yeah, it's easier just driving over to go collect it. So I'll go lease it. Um, lease it now whilst it's sort of cheap. Select lease for £1,000, yes. So I'll go up here, I'll take, take a change in direction. So like I said last episode, these uh, houses are all that's sort of under our control. Um, we've got to sort that mess out there on the road. Um, but hopefully, once we get paid, we can start doing a lot more. No entry there. Stripping maneuver this. 
Um, so yes, once we start any more, then we can buy the bigger equipment that we need. As we already have a loan out, which I don't quite want to extend, but if we need to, then I'll certainly do it. We now own a small front cultivator, which you can barely lift. So this is where the weight on the back would come in handy. Need to make sure I can back up onto there. Yes, yeah, this is where a bigger tractor as well would be brilliant. There we go. Oh, that's huge. So, I might affect our speed. There's some stopping distance. And time. So, I've got to be extra careful. But yep, fairly nice all oh, while wow. I'm not even accelerating here, I haven't even <laughs> good acceleration there. Down there as well. I'm hoping that I could possibly extend out just behind that uh, building by the building. As it would probably help us out a bit. If we did that. So allow create fields. Need a much bigger tractor. No, why? It's not O anymore, it's Y. <laughs> Where's on how many of the key bindings I'm actually remembering from 15? So this is as far as we'll go. Is there? But what we will do is on the drive back up, we will uh, put the cultivator down. We'll see. Can the cultivator? No, it is just a cultivator unfortunately. Can't create fields. Oh well. Wow, I can't even move. Um, Requires diff lock and all sorts. <laughs> yeah, we really, really, really need a big attractor hardly pull it and this is the smallest plow that they do so we look at other brands that the shop do not currently sell well we buy a bigger tractor which I don't once it is, we bought this last episode. I was hoping it'd be uh, good enough. It's good enough for the forestry work. We know that. So that's all right. Just anything else it can't handle, or everything else it can't handle. Uh, no one's really taking care of it, so I'd say it's okay for us to drive over. Um, what we'll do, we'll go over with the front cultivator. And that is creating our path. 
apart from there. So I'd say that's a large enough path actually. Um, right. entertaining for you guys, me failing here with the horsepower requirement of my tractor. Third turn. <laughs> Although we do own that now, so that's one more implement that's good to us. Uh, we do own it. That's going to have to stay like that. So, over, I'll possibly return this plough. So that's all I really need is that road doing. I'll return the plough once I've put this into the shed. So, we have the uh, dirt track. Um, you know what? We'll do the track there, I think. I've put the front weight on this. Be good if we had that one that was in FS15. The, I think it was the one. The turquoise colour. Go. Not like allowing me fields, no. Oh, okay then. <laughs> Wasn't really what I had in mind there for uh, me to go off the edge. Oh well. Still alive, which is good. Yep, yeah, can't get off. I'm stuck. Um, right, this is uh, quite dangerous. Well, what we can do. I was hoping we could do. Attach that up. We can't move that by hand, can we? No. Uh, we'll have to uh, do that another day, I think. The ploughing, as the tractor just cannot handle it. So, we'll send the plough back. Unfortunately, return, yes. Drive this up here. So, that's that area done now. Um, we will go, I'll just chop up the logs that are in here at the moment and then we'll go sell them, I think, and us some good money, hopefully, enough that we can buy a decent tractor that can pull something, <laughs> this is basically the smallest tractor I think. Right. Pickup truck. Ah, oh, the trailer. That's got to go in as well, I think. Probably would help. At least in our property. Well, proper property, really. Let's park that there. And we'll take a road trip to go and sell some logs. Uh, what we'll do, we'll turn the lights on I think. Shut this door up. Let's 
this is something I probably will do quite a lot of the time. I'll uh, bring whole logs back here, whole trees back here. We'll uh, chop them up in here. Looks quite dry. Plus, if we uh, don't finish the job before the uh, before the next go out, and we just leave them in there without leaving the site messy. So I'm pretty sure that trailer would be able to bring back some pretty big logs. Or whole trees, hopefully. That's what I'm hoping for. Useless at carrying these logs about. One bad thing about this pickup truck is it doesn't have uh, the option for ratchet straps to be put on there. Um, you know what, we'll close that up partly. Just enough so I can get out. I'll leave the lights on. Anyway, there we go. On a little road trip, so you'll sell these logs. So the log sale point is up at this end actually. Looks quite nice that area. Um, hopefully, once we clear out the rest of it, um, buy some bigger equipment to so plow it in, cultivate it, create more like a dirt ground area. We can do a lot more stuff and expand the company. Absolutely useless at throwing these logs in the back of this trailer. Oh, nice pick up today. Sorry, mate. Please don't hurt me. Yeah, stop beeping your arm, mate. Calm down. Right, let's go. Break some light. There we go. drive too quickly just in case they do come out again um, but at least we know that we have a pass to be able to sell the logs commercially to our company um, as well this place here requested a quote for um, quite a lot of the trees to be removed around the sort of beach area they'd like, uh, sort of like a bit more car parking or a bigger pool in um, so we'll probably get called in to move the trees there at some point possibly so we are sort of the only company around here in the area that does this sort of thing so logs are sawed here I think you know what, just make sure Um, radio, help icons, colour blind, no. Hmm. I don't think this cell phone anymore. That's annoying. Oh yes it is, back there. Just uh, chuck those two in. There we go. So, 8,000. Wow. 
Got about a thousand pounds there. So that's from two trees. Fairly small trees as well. So if we do a lot more of them, then we will make a lot more money over the coming weeks um, of this series. So, as well, uh, there's a tree nursery. Um, and some of the trees there, they would like taken out because it's coming up to Christmas time. Um, and they would pos there are some people that may like Christmas trees in the garden or them delivering. Um, so yes, we will get paid the worth of the Christmas tree um, plus fifty pounds or hundred pounds, um, depending on how far away it is. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share this video as it really does help. And I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.